How long have uh, you had this problem, man? It, it was a it was a relapse. I've been clean for 13 years. Uh, just went through a really really bad divorce recently. Okay. This is Cranston, Rhode Island City Councilman Matthew Riley being woke up by the police on May the 15th, 2023 in Cranston, Rhode Island. Now, a pedestrian was walking by and thought Riley was choking and needed help and called the police to do a welfare check on him. And while the police were waking him up, the police immediately noticed a crack pipe in his hand. Uh -huh. Yes, sir. Yeah. Oh. I'm just going to pat you down. Yes, sir. And put into into like your fingers. Mm -hmm. like your fingers. Do you have any weapons on you? No, not at all. What? Yeah. All right. Roads open. Cross. You need to go stop. Try not to. Uh, rotate on. Oh uh, no way, dude! Really? Yes. Yes. I was just taking. I was just on my way back from court. Bro. <laughs> Well, a rescue's gonna come check you out, man. I can't let you go. You were literally choking in your sleep. Somebody flagged me down about it. Oh, I have sleep apnea. I'm sorry. Well, and then you have a crack pipe in your hands, so it's like. Please, come on. sorry. Listen, I, yeah. I have a body camera. Obviously, yeah, everything obviously. I have is recorded. You know that. And I, what I've observed is on camera, so I can't pretend I didn't. You know, so a rescue's gonna come here, oh, and Jesus. they're gonna check you out. You know, you, as far as I know, there's no drugs anywhere, so I no. can't, you know, so there's not a criminal investigation. There's more a health or well-being check type Thank thing. Thank you. Um, but, uh, yeah, I obviously have to document it, you know. You can have that back. Thank you. There will, will be no arrest. What? There will be no arrest. No. Um, is there any, are there any drugs in the car or anything like that? No, no, nothing. Oh. All right. How long have uh, you had this problem, man? It, it, was a, it was a relapse. I've been clean for 13 years. All right. Just went through a really, really bad divorce recently. Okay. Um, uh, do you know if any of that was laced with fentanyl or anything? Because you were out, out, and like looked like you were choking. Really? Yeah. Um, That's why somebody literally sprinted and, and flagged me down because they thought you were having a heart attack or choking. Uh, I, no, not that I know of. Seven yeah, I was just carrying out the way. I just. Greg, I've had a second thought, man. It was wrong. Oh, sorry. Sorry, can you uh, sit over towards the front of your yeah, car, please? Yeah. Thank you. If you're unsteady on your feet, just no, find maybe nervous. one of those curves or something. Why don't we? Can you uh, 22 all before a civil complaint, please? You want me to get him over here? Would you mind? Yeah, um, I, I don't mind. Just uh, do me a favor. Can you come over to the front of mine? Yeah. Thanks. Just, just hang out in the front yeah. while I make this phone call. Thanks.
probably dig out just a smaller little rock so we don't have to break anything. Uh, if we can get a little bit with the powder. Uh, the powder? Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll do it. I'll touch it. I got it. Yeah, it's kind of awkward. Yeah. Be careful, because he was on the nod, or like, it yeah, seemed like sure anyways. It's mixed with something else, but... Do you need this knife? Yeah, we use that. Oh, he also has this. Eh, never mind. Careful with that stuff. Is I don't know if that's fentanyl waste or not. There's white all over there. He doesn't yeah. know. Yeah, I was just telling him the same thing because I mean, you don't fall asleep usually from completely, you know, it's not an opiate. Yeah, usually. It's it's good. Good. he claims he was tired and he, and he may have sleep apnea, but I don't think that's gonna flow. especially like this. Yeah. Yeah, only climb a lot too. It's like you stick out like a sore thumb. Well, yeah, right away. Fentanyl? Oh, uh, coke. Yeah. Crack. Pop for crack. I can test it for fentanyl too. Test it for both just to make right. sure because I don't know what we're dealing with. Well, can you just snap a picture of that? Especially yeah. if you put him in a cell and watch him quick in case he goes down quick. Right. Got him. So, Todd, you're going to arrest him. He's going to come in and uh, we'll charge him. And, uh,. He wants to tell a car major and just no, want to pop the car can stay here. Yeah. I'm not getting in it. No, no, no he'll he'll stay like it. that. We'll have we can have him call someone at the station. Have him come down. He can have. I mean, he wants to have his mother come get the car, but I'm not. Gonna, I wouldn't have. Him no, I'm not getting in there, know. touching all that. All that white powder is that. That's a piece that of crack. Piece yeah, of crack. yeah, that's definitely. That's definitely crack. Yeah, yeah, most likely. Whew. Yeah, you can smell it. He's burning up. He has a bunch of toy boy, and should we have a toad? It looks no, like it's like half been, living out of his car. There's like toilet property. trees. We're good. We're on private property. Man, this guy's yeah, look at this. this guy's got a problem. I'll do all the uh, evidence stuff for you. Thank you. All right, so um, is he, uh, Rescue's good with him? They're, they're just finishing oh, up right he's now. Got the okay. He's got the brillo on everything over there. Yep. You see it? Yeah. Yeah, it's on. It's they're, all, they're finishing uh, up right now. That was in his uh, glove compartment. Just ask this question. All right. Yeah, I know. It's not like I have, have an option here, man. Sorry. Let me know if they're a little too tight or anything. We can loosen up. Buy that today? Yesterday. Yesterday. And yeah, you, yeah. You don't. Is the same guy you usually buy it from? I don't really usually buy it off anybody. They're not all honest people. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, so no, I mean, I mean, uh, once or twice. Yeah, but whoever you buy it from, if you if you continuously buy it from them, you know who you're buying it from. This, you don't know what people are putting in it. No, I I understand. You know, they may have made that. But that's a big rock you got in there. What's that, a $50 piece? Uh, 100. 100? Yeah, so I just, just got back into this. I, I, you gotta, uh, this is gonna, listen, I, this is a terrible, terrible situation. We're all in a tough spot, but we gotta do what we gotta do right by the numbers. Oh, It'll help you in the end. Believe me when I tell you. And you'll say to us a month from now, good, best thing that ever happened to me. That's what they all tell us. 
you can't go down this road anymore. No, no. God forbid we find you dead. That that would that's terrible. You yeah. know what I mean? And you were down in the car. No, I mean I was gonna put set up for the seventeenth to go get help and Yeah. You just you, you, you gotta get on a program right away. No, that, I, I mean I, I look at you, yeah. you're not the Matt Riley that we know. Trust know. me. So I and I, I, know. Know. I listen, I your health and your well being is worth way more than any political career. I, I don't care about Yeah, we'll, we'll keep it, we'll keep it. Listen, we're not, we're, we're, we, we don't report nothing to the media unless someone tells them. So, and then arrest records are public record. I'm not going to lie to you. But, there's, there's, there's not much we can do on this. Unfortunately. If I was in your situation, I'd be in handcuffs. No, no, I'm not saying, you know? oh, I'm not saying don't arrest Yeah, yeah, yeah. In terms of media for the kids, as much as Yeah, no, inspired. listen, we are only required to release what we release, and we won't, we have to release an arrest record by law, you know. All right, jump in before you. We just want to make sure, we're going to monitor you, because you've, you've yeah. taken just in some I'm going to pat you down again, all right? You've taken in some fentanyl, Matt, and that's, that's, you know, we've got to make sure you're, you, you don't, may not feel it right now, but God forbid something happens to you. Yeah, you, no, I've never done that. feel terrible so. about that, you know? You're not going to be there all day. You'll be in and out. I'm going to keep your wallet with me. I have your phone already. Do you okay. want me to throw this stuff in the car real quick? Sure. All right. Just step on in here. I'll buck you up. Oh, wait. Matt, who's going to come side. get that car? This is a full cage. What's that? Get in here. Who, who's going to come get this car wrapped up? I would. Huh? I would. All right. Listen, you got to clean this car. Oh, God. It's supposed to be going back in, in tomorrow. Oh. My car's getting fixed. Oh, this isn't even your car? No, it's a rental. Oh, it's a loaner. All right. Car. But, yeah. All right. I mean, there's, there's all shit on the seat. All drugs on the seat. Oh, yeah, I mean, I wasn't drunk. I have an appointment on I don't know, 17th. All right. So. I'll crack a window for you in a second. Thank you. You're going to lock it up? Yep. Cranston City Councilman Matthew Riley has been arrested again, this time facing charges of S.A. and child you-know-what, less than a month after his high-profile arrest for drug possession. Riley, 41, was taken into custody Thursday morning, according to Cranston Police Mayor Todd Petalano. They say he was arrested in North Kingstown, Rhode Island. Court records show the former councilman is facing three counts of indecent stuff with kids, S.A., second degree indecent stuff with kids, and S.A., an enticement of a person under the age of 16. Police allege the charges stem from an incident on May 3rd. He was arraigned Thursday and ordered held without bail. Riley's arrest warrant comes after a legal guardian of a 12-year-old girl unrelated to Riley filed a complaint with the police, according to a press release.